Mushroom? <laughs> They're gonna get it. Mushroom. Three minutes. Three, three minutes, minutes, guys. In three, three minutes, minutes, minutes County, we'll I want somebody to type, oh, mushroom. Oh, <laughs> mushroom. Right, okay. All right, guys, round four is started here. KKG versus Ready Up. We got Ready Up starting uh, in uh, server room. Uh, and in shipping, we got KKG. Nice little skulk pack coming here in hub, meeting Static and Sharpshooter. Ren, Ham, and Dark Pyro coming in for the kill. Nice uh, wa wall drops from there, taking down Static. Sharpshooter takes down Ren. Ham takes down Sharpshooter. One last Marine left. Raccoon uh is a, oh wow what a fight that was the most exciting fight i think in this whole match <laughs> yeah dude raccoon th where was this last game right where was where was raccoon coming out with the with the hero moves you know <laughs> Yeah, wow, uh, we saw some great shooting there, some great pistol kills. We see Hype in uh, repair room just kind of uh, sneaking about. Uh, we see another three marine push in the hub. Ham is in trouble. Dark Pyro and Ren are in there. They are going to make a stand and try to fight this. Sharp Shooter going down. Raccoon going down. Static is in trouble. And Static goes down. They lose three marines and two aliens get lost as well. We see Logistics RT being attacked by Hype. Uh, and we're seeing the mezzanine RT being attacked by Solani, and he's going to go ahead and meet Sharpshooter and escape through the vents where he's going to get pinned by Raccoon. Oh my gosh, and he almost gets killed. Um, some, and that RT was saved in logistics. Great reaction here from KKG. So if we talk about that engagement that happened in Hub where the three Marines pushed in, I really like what Dark Pyro did, which is he waited, and I mean, this is a strategy that it most professional, you know, or semi-professional or, you know, pl talented players employ, um, but you don't think about it as a pub player. Um, he, he stuck behind that pillar and he let that engagement happen uh, and, and waited until he saw them start to reload. And he did die. I mean, he did die, but he, but he was able to get a, at least one kill out of it and, and I believe half a health bar on another player. Um, that is the kind of, you know, patience that you need as a skulk. Uh, especially now that the Skulks are just not as individually strong. Yeah. And so very, very good job by Dark Pyro to sort of wait it out, wait for the opportune moment, and, and make that engagement play out in their favor. Yeah, ready up, coming into KKG's territory in logistics. KKG rallying at this point and just eats them alive, saying, get out of our backyard. Um, nom, and nom, KKG nom, nom, nom. is moving into hub at this point. Uh, we see one Marine Raccoon in elevator transfer. Injured Rezzer just sitting there on the ceiling. Might get the jump on him, and he does. He gets the first bite, and that is so crucial for Skulks. That is the way a Skulk is supposed to be played. All right, Static and Sharpshooter coming in to Elevator transferred against in Injured Rezzer, but that has already been called by Raccoon, and that power node is going to end up going up. And I yeah. see that they just got the mushroom call. <laughs> That's right, mushroom. <laughs> so yeah, we do see Ren is over in ore processing. He's going to go ahead and take down that res node. But you know, KKG, uh, or sorry, Ready Up is sitting on six res nodes. That brings them down to five. So they're they're still in a very good position. They have plenty of res flow. Um, they're definitely rallying this game. Yeah. This is possibly this is probably the best I've seen them playing so far. They're very they're being very aggressive. They're able to push into the other side of the map, keep the fight off of their together. territory. Yeah. Yeah, this is uh this is a good observation now, sharpshooter and oh, static. Ren. That's ridiculous. So so Dark Pyro just came through the vent and you know, a marine in the vent versus a skulk in the vent, the Marines should win every time, but I don't know how Ren was able to get I think a double bite, or at least one bite, on Ren, and and or on a Dark Pyro, and, and just take him out in that vent. That was ridiculous. I want to uh, ask Dark Pyro how he feels about that later. We see Ham and Static uh, just for fighting in observation. Ham takes that win, um, and as far as uh, Ready Up is going, they are uh, owning mezzanine, server room, platform, warehouse, and ore processing, and a little bit of elevator transfer. So cutting this map in half. Uh, just a bit. Six RTs versus four. Um, doing okay. Yeah, you know they're not quite as a. Uh, um, they're not quite controlling the uh, the res 
flow for KKG as well as they would like to. Um, but they are now pushing into repair room, and they're going to hopefully get this down to three res nodes instead of four. They, it does look like that res node is going to go down. Nobody really there to reinforce. We do see alert coming in, Dark Pyro, but that res node is going to go down before he gets there. And now, and now, we see that those uh, crags are going to come under attack, as I think that's where they were planning on dropping their second hive. Definitely. Uh, Leo and Raccoon are going to get taken down by Ren, though. Uh, so that that threat is gone. Welkin is there. Those crags are built, so I think we could see that hive drop fairly soon. Um, although they're gonna probably wait a, a little bit to make sure that they're not sending another wave of marines. And there's the hive drop. That hive is down. Welkin is gonna go ahead and start building that ASAP. Yeah, and with a gorge there, guys, that is gonna help the growth time of that. Um, but looks like he's just gonna put up some defenses right now. We're seeing a we're seeing a Lurk and a Skulk in Elevator Transfer against Static. Oh, and Ham goes down. He was a Lurk. That's 30 personal res. Gone. We're seeing Raccoon and Leo. Look at look at the difference here, Neat. I mean, they are mostly, for the most part, grouped up. I, yes. I did not see that before in, in previous yes. games. I, I, saw, yeah. I saw Ready Up Marines trickling in, Ready Up Aliens trickling in. Um, but they are now using the buddy system. Yeah. They I have their milk know. cards and everything. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, they're, you know, they're holding hands. <laughs> Great uh, offensive mine usage in observation takes down those two skulks, and that is going to get hype, uh, allow hype to take down that RT and pushing them down to three res nodes. Yeah, again, I, I don't know what happened in that locker room, man. I know the locker room is on docking, but they, 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 they must have all switched to a docking map real quick. Just all ran into the locker room, had a little team chat. Yeah, like suck it up, shake it off, shake it off, right? Shake it, come on, guys. Uh, we're seeing uh, five RTs now versus three. We're ready up. Let's, uh, and we see that Robo Factory uh, going down in Hob. That's very standard. Uh, placement for the Robo Factory just to get arcs around the map pretty quickly. Um, aliens do know this. If you've played Alien on this map, you should know this strategy. Uh, and we see Ren running in there and seeing it, so he's going to relay that information back to the, his entire team. And now four Marines uh, from Ready Up in Hub, um, ready to get those arcs out, no doubt, and push towards uh, a base. And these three Marines are now going through South Tunnel and taking a little bit of a detour and into logistics, attacking another Resnote, and that Resnote goes down. That brings KKG down to two Resnotes. Yeah, this is... Um... I, I don't even know what to say here at this point, because uh, look at this. We see a huge this. pinch coming on in shipping. Four Marines are down in shipping, and there are no aliens in sight. Ham had to jump, uh, is, is is there. He's going to try and defend. Dark Pyro has shown up on that Lurk, but man, again, four showing up. That Carapace shell, I think, is going to go down. Yeah, Carapace has been lost. Ham is going to go ahead and clean up a little bit as he takes down Static. But again, three, three still there. Hype does finally get taken out. Leo is still there. Shooter is still there. Weapons two have been completed. Ham, I think, is going to be able to clean this up with Dark Pyro's help. Yeah, he goes ahead and cleans that up. But again, that was a great push. Yeah, that was a great I mean, push. They took out Carapace. Um, they they brought the aliens back from advancement across the map. Yeah, that was uh, that was a pretty good push by Ready Up. I'd have to give it to them there. But the one thing that you do want to take a look at is that meanwhile, while that was going on, they went from six RTs all the way down to three. Yep, yep, they did. And it looks like that they were down to three for about 30 seconds, got another one up and one the blueprint down. So um, again, uh, RTs, uh, it looks like on the map they are pretty close, but uh, KKG is lagging behind a little bit. We do see two arcs uh, right now pushed out in hub. Uh, I would just... Uh, you know, at three or two or three, just start moving those and, and start that offensive. We have a fade on the field, which is going to be Ren, uh, and we have a Lurk and a Gorge. Yeah, so I, I the question is going to be whether they're going to head for shipping first or elevator, uh, uh, sorry, not elevator, repair room. And, and my guess is, my assumption is they're going to go for shipping, but it looks like, it looks like, no, they're going to go for repair. Nope, oh, oh. they turned around. Oh. They need uh, they need better. Uh, uh, no, they are just. I don't think they can. Okay. Yeah, they're waiting. I think they were just waiting for that third. I thought they were uh, using the uh, Apple Maps app. <laughs> 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 they need to update. <laughs> right, go get Google Maps. Get Google guys. Maps. Come on. 
Alright guys, these uh, three arcs are trucking into repair room. A little vulnerable at this point. I don't know if I would put them right in the yeah. middle uh, like that. Biobomb is researching. This. Halfway done, so that kind of helps the arcs a bit. Uh, but they're very exposed. Yeah. And they've that... been absolutely destroyed. I mean, those, those yeah. Marines just got absolutely wasted. There's yeah. no reinforcements. That, that was that was bad. I I, I would have moved I, them I would, north. I would pack them up and get them out yeah. now. Yeah, you might as well. They're not going to do much damage there, except just lose you res. 60% on that hive, uh, and they go down. Yep. But they did get the crags. I suppose that's you know a plus. They did get the crags. Yeah. And uh, sitting on thing? sitting on three RTs for KKG, that actually could um, hurt them. You know, I mean, it's not like they can pop them right back up. Ren right now in or processing meets two Marines, barely gets out of there alive to lose that fade. Um, and we're seeing more arcs being punched out at this point. Four arc, they're sitting on four RTs, uh, the ready up, and they're about to lose another one. It's just being harassed in platform. Two Marines at the start in the entrance of repair room. Leo gets bitten from behind. Hype is going to go down as well. Carapace has just been researched again, and they have Carapace and, Carapace and Biobomb. That is going to help in any arc push. Yeah, absolutely. They did not take down that platform RT, so they are now sitting on five RTs, as we did see, I believe, elevator transfer was completed. Uh, so, you know, a pretty good position for... for ready up here uh, compared to the three RTs of KKG. Yeah, and in hub we're seeing a two fade kind of offensive. Um, ready up needs to phase through to help this. They have ham there um, at with biobomb. Biobombing those freshly made arcs and those arcs are wisely moving back. Sharpshooter, Static and Leo pushing back this offensive. They need to make sure that they hold this and very smart we see those arcs now moving north. Let's see where they go. Yeah, but look at this. Up in platform, we see Injured Rezzer is taking down that RT with Solani on fade there to help. So Raccoon's going to get taken out. But we do see the Sharpshooter is pushing from server room as well. So Solani's going to have to back off as he's pretty low on health. Uh, that RT does go down. So they are now down to four RTs uh, for ready up. You know, I, I don't know I don't know about this, this push on, on repair room. I, I, I can't, I can't see why they, why they're just kind of hammering it home, uh, when they, you know, that that's kind of where they've set up their defense at this point. So, so KKG knows that that's the, the sort of the the spot that they have to push against. They know yeah. that those arcs are now coming out. There's no surprise in it, um, and it's just it's a harder, it's a harder uh, tech point to hit with those arcs. Yeah, and and you know what, these arcs are are in trouble right now, and and you know. Stop going into repair room right now. We know that they got that defended. Well, let's move those arcs down into south tunnels uh, and start trying to take down shipping right. and change it a little bit. Um, oh my god, in trouble here. Uh, in hub. Ah, the phase gate goes down. They're going to lose that robo factory. And Welkin is going to stick like white on rice onto these arcs. Um, and these are arcs are in trouble. Let's see if they can make it back home. Static and sharpshooter coming. Another arc goes down. Weapons 3 has just started. 6% on one of the arcs. Welkin is so determined to take those down. And it goes down in the alien scatter. Yep. So I don't really know. I, You know, this is... The only assessment I can make here is that this is uh, kind of indicative of a... I want to say... Uh, I don't know if it's lack of experience or... Lack of good, and they're gonna GG it. They are GG. Wow. They that was that was it. That's all they this had in them. This is what I'm talking about. Like this game was not over. This game yeah. was not over. They were sitting on but... five RTs. I mean, yeah, okay, two were being like attacked at the same time, but yeah, it it definitely wasn't over. I mean, they they had weapons three on its way. This game was not over, and clearly, you know, they they were doing so well earlier in the game and they were kind of going like, oh, okay, we got this, guys. We got, we, we're doing okay. We got this. We can come back. We can, you know, we can, we can turn it around and then